Liv's back for a dinner, so do you think you could actually go and work the bar for a change? Oh, babe, sorry, I'm at a critical moment here. Rescuing kittens to win more jump tarts. <gasps> you, confession. Went all right, did it? All sorted. You know, Belle's gonna be all right. And so is Lisa, thanks to Liv's little windfall. I take it there's more where that came from. You just go and serve the customers and keep your nose out. Sit down, love. I've got Marlon triple frying us some chips. Oh, do we have to? Can I just have it in my room? And to think I'd almost forgiven you for recreating Mad Max Fury Raw yesterday. Yeah. Paddy's fine. Saw him earlier. I'll go and get some drinks. <clears throat> yeah, in your own time. Hey, how's school, by the way? A bit pointless, a bit boring. Hey, any time you need a note forging, I'm your woman. It's a trap. <laughs> As if. Maybe I could give you some proper driving lessons. I'm 14. It'd be illegal. Details. Mind you, you could do with learning in something a bit newer than mine, you know, something a bit more sporty. We could invest in one for us. F for you. You know, with some of that spare cash you got going to waste. Yeah, good luck with that. Chaz has already knocked me back once with my car, so. Yeah, but that was before she started giving handouts to good causes, so it's a bit different now, isn't it? What are you on about? Well, Belle and Lisa. Have you been giving my money away? Liv, wait! Wait, please! I, I was going to pay it all back as soon as I could. Why not just ask me first? Because it was easier than arguing with you. I'm not proud. Lisa needed it pronto. I, I, I'm so, so sorry. Are you ever going to tell me? Liv. I'm really sorry, OK? I thought she told you this morning. I thought you told her! But, hey, we're all right, yeah? I'm just doing the groundwork for when I talk around for you later. <sighs> we just got talking and it came out. How? Something about giving her driving lessons and her needing a car. She's 14. Hang on a minute, how come I'm the bad guy all of a sudden? Right, so you weren't tapping her up for a new car for yourself? Maybe if you'd have told me what was going on, I could have covered for you. All right, I feel terrible, but I'm not responsible for this. You really are the most selfish, blame-shifting waste of space. None of which changes the fact you've lied, eh? So how about, instead of kicking off with me, you try doing some damage limitation? Hello, lovely. Everything all right? Were you in on it too? With the lies. She has taken my money out without asking me first. That was your money. Oh, so you lied to Lisa too? What were you thinking? I was afraid she'd kick off or say no. How do you know that's what I would have done? Chess, you don't know me. Not properly. I was absolutely going to pay it all back as soon as. Look, I'm really sorry. Please don't be like this. Listen, I want you to go and be with Belle. It's important. And of course I would have given her the money. You just didn't trust me enough to think that I would. You don't know me. And yet I might think that I'm part of this family, but I'm not. Not really. Everything all right? You know that money that Chas gave us? It was Liv's. She had no idea that Chas had given it to us, and now she doesn't feel like she's part of the family. Oh, you're as much ours as if you were blood. Of course you are. But I have totally screwed up here. I wanted to tell you today, but I didn't want you to be upset or hurt by it. Now look. Yeah, well... That's down to me. I said to keep it. No, you can. And there's more there when you need it. Hey, love. You've done us proud. <laughs> <laughs>